guys, welcome to fourth grade, chapter three, lesson five. We're gonna go ahead and get started with number two. So all I want this to do is to first estimate, which is super easy. So 73 would round to 70, and 28 would round to 30, okay? So your estimate would be three times seven is 21, and then add on those two zeros. So that's our estimate, okay? Now, the math is gonna be pretty easy too, okay? Eight times three, is it's going to be 24, 4 down, carry our 2. 8 times 7 is 56, plus 2 more, 58. Okay, so now we go in and we do our tick, tack, toe. Okay, we don't want to use that 2 anymore. We're done with the 8. Don't want to use that by mistake anymore. And I need to hold a placeholder 0 in there. Okay, now 2 times 3 is 6, and 2 times 7 is 14. Add those two up. 4, 14, carry 1, 6 plus 4 is 10, okay, so 2,044, okay, we're going to go ahead and do that again, 48 would round to 50, and 38 would round to 40, well, 5 times 4 is going to be 20, and then I still need to add on those two zeros, don't let that fool you just because 20 ends in a zero, okay, so, now we're going to do the math, okay? 8 times 8 is 64, carry our 6. 8 times 4 is 32, plus 6 more, 38, okay? We're going to go tick, tack, toe. Now 3 times 8 is 24, carry our 2. 3 times 4 is 12, plus 2 more is 14. Add them up. 4, 12, carry our 1, 7, 8, and then 1. Okay, not so bad. Okay, we're going to do one more. Okay, our estimate, 59 is going to round to 60, and 52 is going to round to 50. Okay, 6 times 5 is 30, and then we're going to add on those two zeros. Okay, all right, so now 2 times 9 is 18, carry our 1. 2 times 5 is 10, plus 1 more is 11. All right, now tick, tack, toe. Five times nine is 45. We're going to carry our four. Five times five is 25, plus four more is 29. Add them up. Okay, eight, six, ten, carry our one, and three, 3,068. You guys are going to do five, six, and seven. Okay, we are going to come down where it says baseballs come in cartons of 84 baseballs. The team orders 18 cartons of baseballs. How many baseballs does the team order? So 84 times 18. And whatever our answer is, it's going to be in baseballs. Word problem, word answer, guys. Okay. So 8 times 4 is 32. Carry our 3. 8 times 8 is 64 plus 3 is 67. Okay. Tick, tack, toe, and then 1 times 84 is going to be 84. Add them up, okay? 2, 11, carry our 1, 14, and 15. So 1,512 baseballs, okay? It's a little messy. You can use scratch paper if you want to, always, okay? There are 16 tables in the school lunchroom. Each table can seat 22 students. How many students can be seated at? at lunch at one time. So I'm going to put the 22 up top and I'm going to put the 16 on the bottom because when I do the second row, it's going to be easier for me to multiply by one than it is for me to multiply by two. Okay, so six times two is 12, carry our one. Six times two is 12 again, plus one is 13. Okay, now six, tack, show, and then one times 22 is 22. Add them up. Two, five, so, 352 students. I want to know how many students can be seated at one time at lunch. So, 352 students. Okay, then go on to the back, and you are going to go ahead and take care of a lesson check, one and two. You can totally do those. We are going to go ahead and take care of three, 
um, on Sparrow Review. It says one Saturday an orchard sold 83 bags of apples. There's 27 apples in each bag. How many apples were sold? Well, 83 times 27. Okay. Seven times three is 21. Carry the two. Seven times eight is 56 plus two more, 58. Okay. Tick, tack, toe. Two times three is six. Two times eight is 16. Add them up, and whatever it is, it's going to be in apples, okay? 1, 14, carry the 1, that would be 12, carry the 1, and 2. So 2,241 apples, okay? Number 4 says, Hannah has a grid of squares that has 12 rows with 15 squares in each row. She colors 5 rows of the 8 squares in the middle of the grid blue. She colors the rest of the squares red. How many squares does Hannah color red? Okay, so she has 12 rows of 15 squares. Okay, she colors five rows of eight squares. In the middle, green, blue, the rest are red. So we're going to find out how much each of these is, and then we need to find the difference, so we're going to subtract. Okay? So I know that my bottom number is going to be 40 because I know that 5 times 8 is 40. Okay, 12 times 15, I'm going to go ahead and do that on scrap paper because I don't know that off the top of my head. Okay, 5 times 2 is 10, carry our 1, 5 times 1 is 5, plus 1 is 6. Okay, tick, tack, toe, and then 1 times 12 is 12. Add those up. 0, 8, 180. So now I'm going to have 180 minus 40. Okay? I'm going to subtract 0, 4, 1. Red squares. Okay? All right. Pause that, go back, make sure you're showing your work, okay? All right, so Gabriella has four times as many erasers as Leona. Leona has eight erasers. How many erasers does Gabriella have? Well, it tells you Leona has eight, and Gabriella has four times as many. Well, eight times four is 32, so 32 erasers, okay? Phil has three times as many rocks as Peter. Together, they have 48 rocks. So we have Phil and we have Peter, okay? Phil has three times what Peter has, okay? So if Peter has one, Phil has three because he has three times more. And together, they have 48 rocks, okay? This means that we have to take the total number and divide it by how many blocks we have. So one, two, three, four. So 48 divided by four is going to, four goes into four once, four subtract at zero, bring down our eight, four goes into eight twice. That means that each one of these blocks is going to be worth 12, okay? Okay, so how many more rocks does Peter have than Phil? Or sorry, does Phil have than Peter? Okay, so that means that Phil has 12, 24, 36 rocks. And Peter has 12. Well, I need to find the difference. So I need to subtract. Okay, 6 minus 2 is 4 and 3 minus 1 is 2. Now, the other way to do this is to go once we get here and we know that all of those are worth 12 cross out what they have that matches and then just worry about what they have extra okay 12 and 12 is 24 okay which is the same answer we got here okay now 24 more rocks all right guys thanks for hanging out for 3.5 come on back for 3.6 see you soon